From King Kong and Tarzan to the Planet of the Apes, large gorilla-like primates have captured the imagination for hundreds of years. These fictional characters are often scary, dangerous beasts. But what is a real-life gorilla like, and how fearsome are they in the flesh? Make no mistake, the male silverback gorilla is huge. They are the biggest primate on Earth, and they weigh over 200 kilograms. That's the same as a fully grown tiger. They are immensely strong too, and unlike us, their arms are thicker, longer, and more muscular than their legs. In fact, they are six times stronger than humans. But how dangerous are they? And do they really eat bananas? In this episode, we're going to find out all about this absolutely amazing animal. Sorry. Wild Bites – Gorillas like monkeys, gorillas belong to a category of animals called primates. But gorillas aren't monkeys, they're apes, which is a family that includes chimpanzees, orangutans, gibbons, and humans. Want to know a quick way to spot the difference? Most monkeys have tails, but like us, gorillas don't. They're also bigger and much more intelligent than monkeys. But we'll come back to that later. Gorillas are only found in Africa, where there are mountain gorillas, which have darker, thicker fur, and lowland gorillas, which are slimmer and more greyish in colour. Both species mainly live in dense forests, but they actually spend the vast majority of their lives on the ground, despite being excellent climbers. Well, most of the time. The silverback, so-called because of his silver-grey back hair, is the male leader of the gang, or troop, which is made up of a tight-knit family group. There is usually only one silverback, along with several females and youngsters. The females tend to only have one baby at a time, and young gorillas are highly dependent on their mothers for the first six years of their lives, while they learn the ways of the jungle. Males become mature at about eight years old, but they won't grow the greyish hairs on their back quite yet, so they're called blackbacks. At around 13, they become full-blown silverbacks, ready to defend their troop from intruders. So how dangerous are they? Well, in spite of their brute strength and long canine teeth, with gorillas, it's more often about intimidation than physical fighting. They like to show off just how strong they are, beating their chest to assert their authority. Occasionally though, they do come to blows and they can do some serious damage to each other. Sometimes they even fight to the death. Yet very few humans have ever been attacked. So the reality is that they are much more gentle than they look, but maybe don't rub them up the wrong way. When it comes to gorilla dining, don't let the cartoons fool you. Wild gorillas don't eat bananas, which aren't even native to Africa. And although some gorillas do eat fruit, they mostly eat vegetation, like leaves, shoots, and pith, which is the stuff at the center of the plant stems. That massive dome on their heads is full of muscle for grinding up all that chewy vegetation with their teeth. So it's not all brain up there, but they're certainly highly intelligent animals. Scientists have identified around 25 gorilla vocalizations, which they use to have a bit of a chat. And some captive gorillas have even been taught a form of sign language. This all goes to show that they aren't so different to us after all. And the similarities don't end there. They have 32 teeth in their jaws, which is the same as humans. And they even have unique fingerprints too. In fact, they share 97% of their DNA with us, which makes them one of our closest animal relatives. But unlike us, there are less than 900 mountain gorillas left in the entire world. That's roughly the total number of passengers on two long haul flights. 
Because of their forest home being cut down, and also because people sometimes kill them for their meat, they are dangerously close to extinction. To make matters worse, being so closely related to us means that they are at great risk of catching human diseases. Let's do what we can to make sure these gentle giants have a safer future. <laughs>